In this video, I'm going to show you how to create table cells in your HTML tables using the TD tag. And these are critical to your tables. Without these, tables will not function. I'm going to show you how to use them right now. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. It's Bjorn from Higher Learning Lab, where I help you code better so you can earn more for yourself, for your clients, and for your business. If it's your first time here, hit subscribe, then hit the bell notification icon to notify it when I publish more tutorials for you. With that out of the way, let's learn more about HTML table cells, how to use them, where to use them, when to use them, over in the screen capture. I'll see you there. So on your screen, you see an HTML table. You see how it displays on the right. You can see the code on the left. And a table is basically made up of three, sometimes four components. We have our opening table tag, with also a closing table tag at the end, an opening row tag, which is TR, and a closing row tag after the row is complete. We have a table head tag, which is optional. You won't see it on every table. And we have content between the table head tag and then a table closing tag, or a table head closing tag. And in a different row, we have a table cell, or a table data tag, and a closing table data tag. Now the TD is traditionally what's referred to as the table cell. And each of each TD is a box inside of a row. So if we look at our actual table, we see we have a row here that has three cells. One says North America, one has the number 50, one has the number 60. And if we refer back to our code, we have our first TD with North America in between, and our first, a second opening closing TD tag with a number 50, our third opening closing TD tag with a number 60. And that's what defines the table cells is those opening closing TD tags. Now up above in the first row, we have TH tags, which are for table headers. The table heading cell is just like a regular cell, except for the fact that if you have a TH, by default, the, the browser will interpret that as being a header and it will bold it and center it by default. So as you see here, this is, this is the default display. The TH tag content is bolded and centered, whereas the uh, regular table cell content is not bolded and it's aligned to the left. That's the only difference between a TH and a TD, but they are both considered table cells they just display slightly differently. And that's all there is to HTML table cells. I hope this video helps you. If you haven't done so yet, hit subscribe, then hit the bell notification icon so you're notified when I publish more tutorials for you. And next up is clicking one of these videos that popped up on the right hand side so you can learn more about coding. And until next time, keep crushing it and I will see you in the next video.